Um, so once again, I reiterate that we're talking just about the animal sign so of the year. Yep. We're leaving out seven eighths of the chart. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So, so, so people. Are so aware. it's it's definitely not the be all and end all. And mm. there's always different ways of looking at things. Uh, my I tend to look at a few different methods, but the main method I use is looking at the life cycles of the animal signs yep. within the current year okay. and looking at how that affects different areas of life mm -hmm. um, within the current year. And that makes sense. So, and also the interaction, obviously. Yep. So horses in 2024 need to pay more attention to the spiritual side of life. Okay. Because there's dramas playing out. Oh. Mm -hmm. So if horses read my recommendations for last year, for 2023, mm. They'd no, un, I talked about justice wielding a dual-edged sword, double-edged yep. sword. Okay. Okay. So last year, a lot, we all think we're the hero of our own story. Mm. We all think we've done the right thing. It doesn't matter who. Most of the time, that's not the case. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, if, okay. If we're brutally honest, honest with ourselves, yeah. Yeah. that's not the case. Last year, horses... We're swinging a sword of justice and they found out that it's got two edges. Okay. okay. Came back. It came back and cut them. Um, because we're all, we're not angels. Mm. No one's an angel. No one does everything perfectly, no matter what they say. Um, so this year though, because one of the life cycles is... If the life cycle for the horse in dragon creates indecisiveness. Mm. Okay. So just swinging between like, I don't know, I do know, I don't know, I do know, I don't know, I do know. Um, the, they need to look for signs that catch their attention. Mm. And that's where the spiritual side comes in. Um, many horses just will gallop through life yeah don't really pay attention to their surroundings just keep going and going and going and going mm. um don't really look at the signs around them that are maybe giving them a few warnings mm. <laughs> maybe slow down maybe do this maybe do that really do need to do that this year um okay. So especially since last year, they were the ones swinging that justice sword around, yeah. saying, I'm in the right, you're all wrong, I'm, I'm the best, I'm the ethical <laughs> one, I'm the dragon's karma. Mm. So if, you, if, if you're a horse and you were swinging that sword, the justice sword around, and you're, you weren't worthy of swinging the justice sword around, then this year... It's the sword's going to come back and cut, number one, especially if you don't look at the signs and pay attention to your surroundings and going, okay, well, I'm the one that's in the wrong. Yeah. I've done the wrong thing. And that, that's what horses need to do. Very difficult for a horse to admit that they're wrong. Very difficult. Very difficult for a horse to apologise. No. Oh. Mm. Well, the horse is the cardinal sign for fire. Mm. <laughs> so, pure fire. Pure fire and cardinal as well. The cardinal signs are the staunchest of all the signs. So that's your rat, your rabbit, rooster and horse. Those are the ones with the pure elements. That's exactly yeah. right. So, And even though like the rabbit may appear to be timid, may appear to be, you know, easygoing, mm. uh-uh. They're a cardinal sign. They're the stubborn. <laughs> They're very stubborn. So the same thing with the horse. Very stubborn, cardinal sign, doesn't like to be told what to do. Unfortunately, though, this year, you need to look at the signs. You need to wonder whether you're the one that's in the wrong, whether you've done the wrong thing, and then fix it. Uh, and... Actually, interestingly, the issues will mainly revolve around children, 
uh, romantic relationships, whether that's spousal or boyfriend, girlfriend mm. or girlfriend, whichever the case may be, it doesn't it matter. It all relationship, all romantic relationships issues, count. Eh? Yep, issues. Um, and health. And health. And health. Oh, so, okay. So the dragon, the dragon's a karmic sign, mm. as we discussed earlier. Yep. In 2023, many horses were the ones out there with the... The scales of justice, I won't say sword, I'll say scales of justice, saying that, you know, we're, we're the judge. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we're the ones that can tell that you're guilty. And unfortunately, when you point a finger, yeah, there's always three fingers pointing, pointing back. back. And some horses are going to learn that lesson this year. <laughs> <laughs> um, Don't be too judgy, eh? Well, that was last year. They shouldn't have been too judgy and they mm. shouldn't have been too pushy about other people are, are bad people. Mm. Okay. And now this year, if they've done that, if they've done the finger pointing and the all of that sort of stuff, then this year it's going to catch up, um, which is fine, <laughs> which is fine. Um, so as mentioned, just then with the children and romantic relationships and health that's where all the changes are really going to happen for horses this mm. year relationships um, and health yeah opportunities and temptations for horses during a dragon year most positive interactions come from older people though mm. if a horse is in a committed relationship keep it in their pants do not be tempted to stray mm. Singles, though, mm. harness that energy. Get Put yourself out there. <laughs> Play the field. Just don't break too many hearts. Mm. Um, you, basically, they get lots of opportunities. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, they've got that energy. Mm. Opportunities. And, and that's the thing with committed horses is they've still got the same opportunities that the singles do. <laughs> so they need dragons, to behave themselves. Dragons are karmic here. Mm. Need to can be themselves. very bad if they stray mm. or be dishonest about it. Yeah. I mean, you can say, if, you, you know, if you're not happy in your relationship, actually say, I'm not happy in my relationship. Like, very simple. Mm. Anyway, the horse is an uh, interesting year, interesting mm. year. Many dramas, many dramas. Now, career and money. Should be good Mm. as long as they can keep career or work and personal separate. Yeah. They need to be kept separate. Um, Still good stars for work and income for horses. So um, maybe not as bright as they have been Mm. um, in the past few years, but quite steady. So it should be okay. Mm. 2024, focus more on day-to-day employment. Um. Horses should forget about investing. They should forget about I'm going to win a lotto, all that sort of stuff. It's day-to-day, regular income, go to work, get paid. Mm. Okay, avoid the gossip, avoid the workplace dramas. Don't get involved because horses can get involved in all of that. Mm. Um, But this year, they're the ones that are going to wear it. Okay. Okay. So whoever instigates the workplace rubbish won't be the one that pays for it if the horse gets involved. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, so that's uh, an interesting year for the horsey. Mm. Um, yeah, health-wise, health-wise, it's, um, we've got the yang wood. Now, it really doesn't work in reverse. Stems don't really support Port the branch. branches it, the other yeah. way. The okay. branches support the stems. Yeah, because horses that's, fire. And the horses fire, so it doesn't really get any help. Mm from the yang wood and it doesn't get any help from the from the dragon. wet earth the oh, dragon the yeah. dragon has water inside so it's wet earth mm. so if you try and make a fire on a mud mud in a does. mud pit it's gonna, it's difficult yeah. it's mm. difficult to keep it going so that's the year ahead for the dragon it's kind of for the, sputtering it's for the that horse, yeah. Yeah, for the for in the dragon year for the horse, I should say. Mm. Thank you. Um, but keep your head down, keep your bum up, avoid the gossip. Keep honestly, don't be an instigator in gossip. 
don't be an instigator of ethics mm. because you get hauled over the coals about, you know, <laughs> what's that saying? Are people in glass houses shouldn't throw stones. Stones. Yeah, and yeah. that's horse. Horse. The last year and this year, horses have been throwing stones while they've been inside a glass house. Mm. Or last year and leading into this year. Yeah. And I'm okay. saying, put the rocks down, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> put the rocks down. Yeah. You, <laughs> you, you're going to be in trouble. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, so horses need to be very aware of what comes out of their mouth now. Mm. Um, they need to also watch out for signs and they need to avoid being the instigator of drama yeah. or being drawn into drama. Yeah, okay. Um, and they should get through the year okay. Yeah. And they should yeah. be pretty good. But stay away from <sighs> drama. Stay away. away from if, drama. You, if you're married, don't. Temptation, oh my God. Yeah. Temptation <laughs> That's and, right. and regarding uh, business, well, not so so. Just go to work, do your job, yeah. and go home. Mm. That's it. Yeah. Well, it sounds more like a year they need to keep their heads down yeah. and just, um, you know, play it quietly and Very safe. quiet. And Very safe. quiet. Yep. Under the radar. <laughs> mm. Okay. Yeah. So, so that, that's the horse. That's for, the horsey for, for the this year. year. And the snake as well. We just did this. So a bit of a dichotomy between the two fires, interestingly, Mm. because the snake's fire, at least in the solar version of Patsa, and the horse's fire, but very different results. But they they also should be keeping a calm year. That's the one thing they've got in common. In common, yeah. 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 The snake will have a calm year, Mm. no matter how hard they try. Yeah. The horse will have to try to have a calm Calm year. year. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's the big difference between the yin and the yang fires. So, yeah. Yeah. 